Today is downtown Sioux Falls' first art and wine walk of the summer. Kelly Land's Max Hofer joins us live from downtown to share what you can expect. Good morning, Max. Good morning, Sophie. Now, downtown Sioux Falls is looking to kick off the summer with the return of the May Art and Wine Walk. With it, they're hoping not just to see a boost in business, but optimism for the future. After canceling the May Art and Wine Walk last year due to the pandemic, this year local businesses are excited to see people back outdoors. So many people feeling vaccinated and um, the weather being nice and being able to get outside that that people are feeling a little better about getting out. Owner of the Great Outdoor Store, Deanne Eccles, says that this year is an opportunity to bring about more foot traffic from both in and out of town. The artists certainly have draws, you know, each, each um, artist that's in the different businesses it draws a little bit of a crowd of their own. There are 30 shops across downtown that will host a variety of artists from painters to printmakers to musicians. It gives them a reason to come in, to kind of look around, um, see all of the different variety of shops that we have downtown. We are going to have businesses and locations not only on Historic Phillips Avenue, but also at Uptown, 8th and Railroad. We have a business at Falls Park, Falls Overlook Cafe. You can also pick up wine sample punch cards at each participating store. So you can get 10 samples for $25, or if you're walking around and you really enjoy one type of wine, you can have that wine by the glass for $5. Each store will also have their own policies on wearing masks. Whatever your taste, be it art or wine, no matter where you go, you'll get a taste of downtown culture. The taste for the type of people that live and work down here and the type of shops that they can patronize downtown. Now the Art and Wine Walk is tonight and it goes from 5 to 8 and also parking's free. If you'd like to see a list of participating businesses, we have a link under this story at kelloland.com. Reporting live in Sioux Falls, Max Hofer, Kelloland News.